Welcome to VCHH Playlist. I'm your host, V. Make sure that you like, share, subscribe. Um, I know I said that part three was my last part on the uh, humility uh, and humbleness. Um, <clears throat> servanthood, humility, and humbleness. But um, this is. <laughs> um, my point of the last video was the great success from God that comes from um, servanthood and humility. Um, I, I know I use my wife as examples and um, to get the point clear across. And, um, you know, keep in mind what I was telling you with the success is that well, one thing I didn't mention is that she makes really good money um, doing the job that she does anyway um, before those um, you know tips and kind gestures um, that these high profile companies um, you know the things that they would do um, from their heart rather God was pulling on them to do that and um, that kind of thing because that's what I believe I think that God pulled on them to do the things that they did um, because of just uh, servanthood. And, the, and one other thing I wanted to mention was that um, these high profile companies and other people that she took care of, and I only named a couple of them to you, but um, they would typically come to her place and try to steal her from the people that she was working for. And that's when you know that your servanthood is at a high level that you're really doing something for God. And that's when you know. That's when you know that you're out to achieve. That's when you know your motives are clean. You know, um, you know, there's people at her job that would wonder why she was promoted to the top and, you know, and why she received the benefit she received. Well, it was because of what she was willing to put in. And she thought less about herself and thought everything about everybody else. And so I enjoyed using that as an example today. Um, I think it was perfect. Um, I know it's her testimony, but I just feel like God gave it to me to use. Um, he did, and that's why I used it. Um, so those are the importances of just really getting to a level of serving where you're not doing it for you at all you're ex not expecting um something back in return and that's what the kingdom of god is like and just know that the benefit was is that if you do these things and where she's motivated to me and you have people in your life that's the same way but where my wife is motivated to me is that if I do this thing without motives, that God would do the same thing for me. That's where it became, that's where it's a motivation. It's like, you know, instead of being like, oh, he wouldn't do that for me, or, you know, that's just something that's special for her. No, he uses people in your life as an example so that you can go out and do the same thing. We're all fishers of men. We all out here are supposed to be fishing. All of us. That's what we do. That's our job. So, thank you guys. Thanks for listening to the servitude, humility, and humbleness. And we'll, we will switch it up next time. In Jesus' name. Peace.